Feeling homesick, Emma invited her brother Kyle over to fix a home-cooked dinner for her new roommates. There's nothing but Chinese food and fish sticks in here. Yeah, I don't think they use the kitchen for anything food-related. Yeah, I'm pumped. My little sister's living in the city, working for an advice column, paying the rent, cooking me dinner. Let's send mom and dad a picture. Yeah, let's do yeah. it. We look, oh, hey guys. Um, this is my brother, Kyle. Nice to meet you. Nice tooth necklace. What are you guys doing? I'm just cooking dinner. There's just a bunch of obituaries in here. Where else would you put them? Hey Kyle, um, do you want to just, just de-skin the bell peppers? De-skin? Like you slowly peel off its skin? Yeah. Um, you guys don't have a spatula, do you? Oh, is that hair? Yes, it's my hair. I cut it off after my last breakup. It symbolizes a new beginning. You should donate it to Locks of Love. But it's my hair. <laughs> I never knew violating chickens was a part of cooking. Yeah, uh, you know, cooking can be a lot of fun. Kyle and I used to take a few classes back in the day. Weren't you homeschooled? We were homeschooled in home ec. All right, and now to clean while it cooks. <laughs> oh, there's, um, there's something in there. It is only clam. Darkness is a rat's natural habitat. Clem's a nice name. With the maiden name of Edgar Allan Poe's child bride. Child bride? You know what's fun about cooking? Um, you can really see your progress. Like, um, eventually, the skin is going to turn brown and bubble up, and that's how you know it's cooking. It's, it's pretty cool, right? <laughs> they teach you all this in cooking class? They were not Martha Stewart or Rachel Ray, but at least now they could bake a cookie.